Take definite direction, humanity's best, reality is supernatural. Please visit us at archangeliccalendar.com for more information and for translations in other languages. And please do not forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Thank you for your continued support. This post's launch time is the East Coast USA at the peak of the new moon 0219220221213, check your local time. The following day will begin at the height of the new moon on 0320220032223, check your local time. If you are conscious that a new day has begun, send love and kindness to all. Today's date on the Archangelic calendar is Infinity C 4A 2A 5 Infinity Infinity N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 N 9 Infinity Infinity R 9 B 9 B 9 G 9 G 9 9 Infinity Infinity B 7 D D Infinity. This day 3 of 13 is named after Archangel Raphael and will feature green hues of healing and abundance. Relevant to our calendar date. Gaia is in, Sir Z's will, Sir Z, our galaxy, acts upon the, infinite universes, will, which is yet a microcosm for, infinitely expanding creator source. The current setting is, spirit, and will remain there. This setting on this day takes on a new meaning as things are becoming renewed and refreshed, and a macro healing effort commences. This day is named after Archangel Raphael, a powerful healer, teacher, and leader. You can find his essence quickly if you feel drawn to nature, follow your nudges. Relevant to our now, we are in the cleanup phase of humanity, sorting through the rubble and rehabbing what is left to save. As dreams blend into our reality, you may have more dreams about daily life. Discoveries abound as outer worldly influences become apparent. Galaxies are shifting authentically. We see alignment in the most profound places. We are on a great timeline with subsequent timelines full of positive alternatives whose only differences are semantic. For example, the ice cream will be delicious either way, although the flavor may vary. Philosophical Buffet. When you take a definite direction, your heart sings, all conflict is removed internally and externally, and you will see a clear path to success. Each person must win the war against their emotions to achieve mastery in a peaceful world. Most people need to be adequately prepared for spiritual warfare. This is why the mystic's path is so harsh, to prepare them for the intensity. People's skin can be any color but the soul does not come in colors. They come as divinity wrapped in a human box which is as eclectic as can be, this is done by design. Semantic style learning, memorizing, will not help you in the higher realms where experiencing is the only way to know. At humanity's best, they save lives and put their peers on better timelines. Society is beautiful when it comes together in love or to comfort each other. When humanity is in harmony, nothing will stand in the way. The importance of continual energy work must be recognized. We concentrate on cleansing, refreshing, renewing, and removing obstacles on a full moon. On the new moon, we get specific about the timeline we wish to live upon. Both are contingent upon each other and become a critical force feeding off each other's momentum. Better to humanize than to objectify. Humanizing creates common ground, while its opposite forces separation. This issue can be found everywhere and is directly cured by invoking unbiased love for all beings. Divine love respects others' infinite souls and regards all beings as an extension of divinity. Imagination becomes powerful when you understand how and why it affects physical reality. This is the difference between a daydream and creating a timeline. Greed will deplete the soul and disconnect the spirit until it becomes so useless to the macro that the only purposeful path is a great downfall. It's elementary to stand behind fairy tales and bask in their light for glory. It is a much more robust situation to radiate in your light. People only understand you from their understanding. You can't teach fish aerodynamics. Be careful who you surround yourself with, their vibration becomes yours. Misery loves company, and being a sounding board for negativity is the same as feeding yourself poison. Reality is supernatural, but it leads to superstition for the unaware. It's better to be in the know than it is to be flattened by this truth. However, it's even better to be supernatural yourself. Remember, prophecy is only valid on the same timeline it was prophesized. It is not essential what makes you smile, it is only crucial that you find many things to make you smile. Gifts are your natural abilities, talent, on the other hand, is achieved through practice. If you combine the two, you have effectively connected the left and right brain, and mastery is imminent. No one person brings about spiritual change, it's a collective effort as we all live our own individual lives. Collectively those lives raise and lower the frequency of earth. 
Suppose you see something that has changed through circumstances out of your control. Find the divinity of the motions and notice the divine shift it manifested. Then trust that the purpose of it all will present itself in divine essence and timing if it hasn't already. There will be no general lines of empowerment. Empowerment will come to those connected to the divine in a very conscious and unique way. As our understanding becomes more remarkable, we can digest the logistics of divinity. Never in its entirety, but it will steadily improve moment to moment. When I hold firm in who I am, infinite creator energy in a specific form, I need not worry about monitoring my thoughts because they flow beautifully, naturally, and without forced effort. Like a flower, do not try to grow, do so. If you put the effort in every day, you are going forward. The ultimate truth is very empowering. Do not pay anything any, fear. Let your energy precede you. Metaphysical tools and color representatives. All archangelic tools are available at all times, not just the ones listed here, and the relevant parties decide the representative from each color. Use the legend below to help you decipher how to best use these weapons. To access the tools below, ask the said being for permission and wield them with great emotion and enthusiasm. Archangel Metatron has full access. The healing hand, left, is active and optimized, as is the striking hand. Blue, Archangel Leo's swords of plenty, is a passive and aggressive attack sword with a complete will. Do not try to wield at all, you will only get in the way, equip, and go. Violet, Archangel Raggle's orb of reassurance, is like having a supportive best friend in your ear. It is incredibly entertaining and amazingly wise, much like Archangel Raggle. A fantastic communication tool. Yellow, Archangel Yabashil sandals, allows your footsteps to bless the earth without extra effort. This tool enables our subconscious selves to be actively involved in the healing process of Gaia. Red, Archangel Raziel's universal key, allows access to all wisdom, knowledge, and kingdoms. This key is a beautiful and wild ride that can take you anywhere. Green, Goddess Sekhmet's healing touch, soothes all physical, spiritual, and mental wounds. Call upon this tool when you are not feeling your best. Indigo, Archangel Ezekiel's Medal of Radiance, allows you to radiate healing and protective energy to yourself and all you wish to send this. It is beyond beneficial for things obvious and not so obvious. Black, Archangel Elion's magical legend, will bring all the information you need to master your physical reality. This tool will not yield any results but will bring forth knowledge and wisdom. Orange, Archangel Heman's song, places well-timed music into your life. Heman exclusively speaks through music, permitting this tool will deliver these messages. Brown, Archangel Ophemiel's charm of divine permission, permits the divine hand of, infinitely expanding creator source, to intervene in your life directly. Teal, Archangel Jejuthin's radiant sounds, attract the most beautiful people to your life and enhance your surroundings with beautiful cosmic sounds. Audible downloads will become readily available. Gray, Silver, Archangel Astaroth's timeline hopper, brings you to a higher timeline than you aimed for. It will always take you a road or two higher. This tool makes everything better across the board. Pink. Archangel Vahu Mana's timepiece, allows you to savor a positive feeling or thought. It brings an element of majesty to your everyday moments and prevents harmful time travelers interference. White. Archangel Taga's Omni-Aid, is a tool that helps you hear above, below, and around someone's spoken words. This tool shows you the real intentions behind someone's comments, it's also an excellent tool for reading cuneiform. Rainbow. Archangel Lion's Bravery, brings you the bravery needed in any situation. Call upon this tool whenever you need to remove self-doubt or if the odds seem stacked against you. Today's assignments. Please use today's tools if you need assistance performing the tasks below. Nothing requires you to do the following. If you are ready, your higher self will call you to duty. If not, skip the meditation. When working alone, Please note it is always advised to hold metaphysical modalities for at least a 360 count. You must always be ready for unexpected calls to metaphysical action without our prompting. Please note, today's assignments are in cooperation with many moving parts, this is our job, we must do it to the best of our ability, the same way the other teams on separate tasks will. The portals created here are optimized and active for use. Many people feel lost and alone because they have not answered the inner calling of the divine. We can do two things to help remedy this situation. The first is to be a shining example of what following the call of the inner sacred is, and the other is to lend light from your heart chakra to theirs. 
Envision your heart, igniting the hearts of all of humanity, for this to work correctly, it is best to know that you are powerful enough to do so. Use whatever colors and modalities you feel are best. To many people are stuck in lack, to help encourage abundance, engulf all of humanity in the following. Red flame, rose gold flame, silver flame, red light, rose gold light, silver light, red plasma, rose gold plasma, silver plasma, and rainbow flame. We are at a significant crossroads of humanity, many will look back at this time and credit it for the changes that will last many millennia. Envision two timelines, one of gold and the other drenched in fog. Encourage humanity to take the golden timeline by being very vocal to your peers as you walk into this beautiful timeline. Mother Earth has methods to help the human body heal. Ground all life to the heart of Gaia with emerald green roots, stemming from our heart chakras to her heart chakra. Cleanse the air of Earth with the following breezes, white, blue, gold, yellow, green, red, silver, platinum, and rainbow. Cleanse the waters of Earth with the following lights, white, blue, gold, yellow, green, red, silver, platinum, and rainbow. Cleanse the landmasses of Earth with the following plasmas, white, blue, gold, yellow, green, red, silver, platinum, and rainbow. Bless the Great Spirit, which runs through us all deeply and profoundly, know that this spirit is the divinity in which we swim so we can exist. Take a moment and connect with this incredible energy, show your love and appreciation for it uniquely. Finish this act of kindness to all of life on earth and beyond with the following. Multidimensional violet flame, rainbow breeze, rainbow flame, rainbow winds of change flame and breeze, rainbow water, rainbow plasma, rainbow electrical strikes, rainbow gamma ray lights, rainbow thundering lights, and rainbow light. Thank you for your service. Today's video is above, please enjoy it.